Yes, that's right. We can do masking like Adobe Premiere Pro in LumaVision. But before that, I'm Yat and this is Filmography. Definitely you have a lot of question how this is even possible with uh, LumaVision where LumaVision doesn't support masking like Adobe Premiere Pro which is using a pen tool to mask out the frame or the picture that you need in the video. It is possible to do in LumaVision but we must to use another software to support this uh, method. Before that, subscribing to this channel will be much appreciated where you will learn a lot of things using a simple method and awesome video. So for this tutorial, I'm going to use an app called Fonto. Fonto was the main app that I always use in my iPad. You still can use any other uh, photo editing app that support masking like Affinity Photo, PixArt and some other apps. So if you see in my previous short movie which is a uh, horror short movie it's me that is the title i will leave the link in the description below make sure you check out that link also it's a horror short movie which is done two three months back okay uh, in that video i did cloning myself because i was the you know both actor so i did a clone myself and there's a portion in that movie which is two characters will be in the same frame. For that particular scene, I used cropping method. I crop half and half to achieve both character in same uh, frame. So now I'm going to use this method, masking method uh, using pen tool in LumaVision. In another way, I would say in mobile platform. So let's go to the iPad so that I can show you how this method can be done. In your new project in LumaVision app, in the first timeline, get ready with your clean slate first. Here I already have my clean slate. Next, select the footage that you want to make a mask. So for here, I will put this one. Okay, this is the footage that I want. In this, I only need the reflection image from the mirror. So for this, I need to remove my original body. So after you select your clip that you want to do masking, take a screenshot. To save it but you must remember this method is very easy to mask if you have a very minimal movement if you have a lot of movement this might be a bit hard to achieve so i already have my uh, screenshot that i need next we go to photo app in photo app select a new project photo album select your screenshot that you take just now and then tap anywhere in the screen add text change the font to impact label why i choose this particular font is because of the background you will know why in a while so in the text do not type anything just press space bar few times like three or four times then select done now you can see a rectangle appeared in your screen first you need to change the color to green this will allow us to key out in LumaVision later so for the color follow my instruction which is for red color put number four for green put two four four and for blue press four this rgb value the color is the most easiest to key out in LumaVision later now your rectangle will be in green color now increase the size of the rectangle i'll be using a 3d effect to easier for me to drag and make it bigger make sure you make the rectangle big enough to cover the whole screen of the screenshot like this after you select it is now you can start do your mask like how you do in adobe premiere pro see i can draw the mask which area that i need to remove which is my main body so using this method you able to select only that one portion that you want to mask so the balance you need to remove all the green color so that you can see the screenshot just ignore the part outside from the screenshot because that will not be in final image so now it's already finished select done so now you have a mask you already created select the camera button in the middle and then replace image 
plain image select the white color color change the opacity to zero apply and then change the size to full hd now use the screenshot will be replaced with empty space save the image as png now go back to your project in lumafusion select the clip that you want to mask copy create a new project file paste the clip in the new project file and then bring in the png file on top of this clip and then make it until full now you already create a green screen mask save this clip as a new video then go back to your original project remove the main clip and then add with the clip with the mask on top of this main timeline then double click to edit this clip and then go to uh, effect keyhole and then key out green screen key now you can see my body is removed adjust the parameter so that it blend well with the original clip now you can see you already done a masking like how you do in adobe premiere pro using a pen tool but with only using a mobile platform <laughs> now you already know in mobile platform everything is possible but like i say everything have its own limitation even in this method have some limitation in term of uh, you can't animate that masking but there is a way to animate the mask i'll show that in my next video not this video because it's already length so i'll meet you in that video until then signing off yard from filmography make sure simple method awesome video